Hello everyone, welcome to Talented Developer. In this video, we are going to see how to convert long to a string in Java using so many ways. So we are going to consider both long. First long is a primitive and it must have some value. Another one is a object or I can also say it is a reference type and it can be null. So let's declare both long then we are going to see the different ways. So I have declared that primitive value as a 15 and it is a primitive long and another one is a object type right you can see here I have given the value as a 30. So our first way is what a string dot value of so what we can do we can declare a string a1 equal to a string dot value of and I can say here primitive value right. So let's copy and change as a a2 and here we can say like primitive value so before printing i can say here using string dot value so at least we can understand what approach we are using let's print both string a to write so once we have printed we can print this hyphen hyphen let's run so you can see using that string dot value we are able to get 15 and 30 so here if object value is null then definitely you are not going to get exception but you will get here value as a null so the next way is long dot to a string so let's declare a string b1 and i can say here long dot to a string so first time we are going to convert the primitive one next one what we can do just copy change with b2 and object one so let's copy this whole line and I can say here long dot to string and change with b1 and b2 correct let's run so you can see the next way is also working fine so in this case if object value is null then we are going to get that null point exception so please check so next one is what using the plus operator so I can say a string c1 equal to double quotes and we have to use plus operator then primitive value correct so again copy and change here c1 with c2 and we are going to convert that object value so again copy this four line so this is the common line and change here using plus operator right and here what we have to use c1 and c2 right so let's run you can see that all these three ways working perfectly and here if object value is null then again we are going to get only null so the next way is string dot format so i can say here a string d1 equal to a string dot format and at first place we have to use percentage d and that primitive value right so again copy and change d2 and here again we have to use object correct this long again what we have to copy come down and here we can say a string format right change d1 and d2 let's run you can see right again we are getting perfectly so if you are using object or i can say reference type long then please check that value is null or not because in some ways you might be get null point exception so all four ways working fine another way is like we can use a string builder or a string buffer so let's go to the another way i can say string e1 right and here we have to use a string builder correct here you can use a string buffer also and we have to use append and what we have to append that primitive value correct and after that we have to convert here to a string so again copy paste change e1 with e2 and here again we need object value copy this four line because it is a comma line for us and copy and just paste let's run 
so you can see right first way perfectly working second way perfectly working third way perfectly working fourth way perfectly working fifth way is also working perfectly so all these five ways perfectly working if you want you can also try decimal format so that's it from my end i hope this video is going to help you to convert long to a string please like the video and you can give your feedback in the comment section thanks everyone